I'm Jeffrey, and I'm Rusty. It has been two years since the grand opening of Perfume Passage, and much has changed since then. We've gotten settled in our new space, and as you would expect, being fellow collectors, acquiring artifacts never ends. We have been working on our database, an online museum, which we expect to go live sometime later this year. When we were forced into lockdown at the beginning of the pandemic, we brought the museum to you through our e-news series. We took you through the passage, the drugstore, and the deco gallery. We've shared unique artifacts, new acquisitions, and we've incorporated fun, new educational materials in each of our newsletters. The Perfume Passage Journal, a digital publication, was inaugurated with a look at the Moody Perfume Company and Italy's influence on the perfume, cosmetics, fashion, and beauty world. Our second journal covers the story of Roche, a French company, and we have a list of other topics we will cover in future journals. We look forward to the opportunity of hosting upcoming events, especially the IPDA convention in 2022 in Chicago. You will enjoy our permanent collection, as well as our temporary exhibits that we have been putting together for your enjoyment. Some of these will include Made in Chicago, It's a Miniature World, Avon Calling, The Artist Series, and many more. And you'll enjoy traveling through time in a passageway, visiting an 1800s American drugstore and soda fountain, and experiencing the opulence of the Art Deco era. And to satisfy your curiosity, Please make time to spend in the library, where you will find books about glass, scents, perfumers, fashion, and other topics. We look forward to welcoming everyone in person in 2022. Until then, please follow us on Facebook, Instagram, YouTube, and sign up for our Passageway newsletter by visiting our website, perfumepassage.org. Thank you. And see you soon. Thank <laughs> you.